Jennifer Lewis' admiration for the late Tina Turner has a lot to do with love. Lewis spoke to people about her recollections of the 12-time Grammy winner and her experience portraying her mother, Zelma Bullock. In the 1993 movie What's Love Got to Do With It after the legendary queen of rock and roll passed away on Wednesday at the age of 83 after a protracted illness. In an interview with People, the I Love That For You actor discussed her response to Turner's passing. She said, I tried not to cry because I'm 66 and at some point, we all have to learn how to mourn and not fall apart. She was among the greatest entertainers to have ever lived therefore I had to allow myself to cry. She says, I feel like a mother, a sister, a friend, a teacher, and I'm grateful to Tina for being who she was. I learned so much from her, including how to be sassy and move. When Lewis was touring the country with the musical Yubi in the 1980s, she attended one of Turner's concerts at a four-star hotel in Toronto and was given the opportunity to speak with him backstage. She didn't respond, oh, honey, get up. When I knelt down, because she could tell I was sincere, the woman recounts. It's not as if she didn't see me praising her from the audience because I was sitting in the front row, although Lewis missed the opportunity to meet Turner while What's Love Got to Do With It was being made. She serendipitously ran with Bullock and her older daughter Aline in a vitamin store after the movie was released, I overheard her ask, Aline, which vitamins am I getting? And I knew that voice right away. I turned to look, and there she was, Lewis says. Tina resembled her mother perfectly. Even at her age, the tight physique and Tina-like face were present, along with the legs. Bullock then extended a personal invitation to Lewis, which launched their close relationship. Aline called me when, Zelma, passed away, and I sang at her funeral, the woman claims. I'm grateful we had Tina Turner for as long as we did because I adored her with all of my heart and soul. Lewis also had the opportunity to see Turner and Beyonce sing Proud Mary at the 2008 Grammy Awards in Los Angeles. I sprinted forward. Despite being seated in the audience, she says, I simply went down the aisle to get that close to Tina and the strength of those two women. Developing what's love got to do with it Lewis found it particularly moving because it was her first time portraying a mother. Now that they called, I was thinking, Tina Turner's mother, even though I'm the mother of black Hollywood, she said. Since Angela, Bassett, and I are only two years apart in age, she explains. Of course, they reassured me about how young Tina's mother was when she had her. She goes on to say that so much of what I loved about Tina was how she showed us how to have the courage to walk away, continue to be our true selves, and rise above the bulls. Dot.